This is the story of six men who came from Budapest, Hungary. They were driven out of Europe, went to live in the US, and built the atomic bomb in Los Alamos. They went to Hollywood to make propaganda films for the armed conflict with Nazi Germany. Individually and collectively, each of these Hungarian Jews declared war on totalitarianism. Michael Curtis was originally called Mahali Kertes Kaminer. He carved out a career in Hollywood and made Casablanca the most famous film of all time. Endre Erno Friedman became Robert Kappa. Armed with his camera, he went to war alongside US troops and became the world's most famous war photographer. John von Neumann, originally Janos Neumann Margitai, was the mathematical genius of his age and devised the structure of the modern computer. Leo Szilard became a physicist and a molecular biologist. He developed the theory of the nuclear chain reaction and blazed the trail for the atomic age. Eugene Wigner, in 1963, he was awarded the Nobel Prize for his contributions to nuclear physics. And Edward Teller helped to build the atomic bomb, then the hydrogen bomb, and became one of the most controversial scientists of his age. In the past, they had all been forced to flee, first from persecution in their Hungarian homeland, and then from the Nazi regime's racist mania. When the USA was attacked in Pearl Harbor and thus became one of the warring parties, these men went to war as well, each in his own way, but all with the same goal, the same mission, and the same enemy. Curtis turned the romantic drama Casablanca into the best-known propaganda film in cinema history. Kappa was in one of the Allied troops' landing craft in Normandy on D-Day. Szilard persuaded Albert Einstein to write the letter to the U.S. president that became the catalyst for the Manhattan Project, the American atomic bomb. It was these men, the Hungarian scientists, who launched the Manhattan Project and designed and helped to build the atomic bomb. They knew why they had to prevent a Hitler victory at all costs.